In today's Web3 gaming video, we've got some big news from Neon Heroes. If you've missed the last playtest, finally, there's one to try again. We love this game. And some big news coming up in a game we want to show you, Etherscape. What's up gamers, my name's Mike and I'm your host here at Fungible Games. Now without further ado, let's dive into our first story, which is Neon Heroes. If you've missed the last playtest on this one, this game is genuinely so much fun. The different cat dynamics, there's so much to it. But let's focus right now. They're introducing their new playtest, the biggest one yet, playtest 3, as well as an airdrop event. So if you want to grind it out for some valuable Neon tokens, now's your chance. But this game is honestly so much fun. Even if this was for free, you definitely have to check it out. Out. They're launching a new map called Airbus, which is covered in ice. And there will also be two new character classes, the Scout and the Mage. Now, as for Playtest 3, rumors are it's going to start around August 22nd. However, earning those airdrop points are going to be from the specific period of September 4th to September 25th. So if you want to earn those free Neon tokens, make sure you link your Solana wallet with the Epic Game Store and the Neon Heroes website. Now, this is the same style as their last airdrop event. However, if you didn't participate in that, it's pretty simple, head on over to the Neon Heroes website, join the airdrop, and it'll show you all the steps in detail of what you need to do to accumulate those valuable airdrop points. So the total prize pool for this one is going to be a whopping 5 million Neon tokens, and the players ranked in the top 20% will get an added bonus. So if you've got the time to grind, it's definitely worth it for you. Also, if you have one of those Guardian or Neon Heroes NFTs, those are also going to give you some points. And if you don't have one yet, it might be worth your time checking out and potentially getting one. To ensure you get the most bang for your buck for accumulating airdrop points, make sure you're logging in every day, taking part in those daily quests, the special missions, and everything that they have laid out for you on their airdrop portal. Now, another benefit for holding the Neon Hero Genesis NFT is remember that part in the beginning where I said there's going to be a playtest starting around August 22nd? Well, you must have the Genesis NFT to participate in that, and that's going to be really valuable because you can scale up your skills in the game all the way until September 4th when it becomes live for everybody. But wait, there's more for this one. Are you a content creator or do you enjoy streaming yourself gaming well now's your chance to earn even more meow points because neon heroes is putting in something special for you creators so from here make sure you're following neon heroes on their x platform as well as their discord so you can be up to date with everything happening for this big playtest 3 event next up we have etherscape now this is a big deal because etherscape just ranked top five trending in games in all of the epic game store and this is huge because it's a crypto game it's alongside games now like fortnite assassin's creed Genshin Impact, which have millions of players each month. Etherscape is a dungeon crawling MMORPG where players team up to explore dungeons, fight enemies, and participate in special events. The game itself was built by a small team led by Sam Bayless, and despite its small size, it stood up against much bigger titles. The game's success can also be thanked in a large part to partnering with Engine, which brings features like NFTs and trading to the game. Etherscape has also topped the charts in several categories for newly released games games on the Epic Game Store, including number one dungeon crawler, number two MMO, number two roguelite, number two in co-op, and even number three in RPG. Etherscape released its open alpha on August 16th, and the team is also preparing for the engine multiverse coming on August 27th. This upcoming launch will allow players to use their NFTs across multiple games, showcasing true interoperability and the potential of digital assets or NFTs. And like we alluded to earlier, a big part of this game's success can be attributed to Engine as the game went through Engine's Spark program. Now, if you're a crypto investor or a game developer, I think Engine is a great platform to start looking into. They're an OG gaming protocol around since 2017, and they're really ramping things up for Q3 and Q4 2024. And if you're watching this as a Web3 developer, definitely look into Engine. They have so much to offer. They've got their built-in Web3 wallet with 3 million active users already, their NFT.io marketplace for creating and trading NFTs, and Engine Beam, a tool for distributing NFTs through QR codes. Well, that wraps it up for this Web3 news video. We're so excited to see more from Etherscape and Nian heroes. Now we've already covered Nian heroes a few times, dropping some pretty big Easter eggs. So make sure you check out one of those videos on our playlist or to read up more on gaming news or gaming walkthroughs, make sure you head on over to fungible.games.